Welcome back, my comrades. I am Victor Barisov, and today we are continuing Fallout 76. I believe this is day 16, 17, something like that now, guys. I'm not quite sure what day it is now. I think I've lost my marbles again. But we do have to continue this today. So my plan is for today to walk from here, walk around the side of the lake, and head all the way back up here, of course. I have got quite a bit of arms now, as you can see. I bought a few things with them, but I have been doing the daily challenges. As you can see, I've done quite a lot of them. Social, I've done a lot. I've done all the things once. One, I cannot get to work. Magically, would you believe this or not? Uh, where is it? World, I believe it is. I've done most of these. Uh, this one, just, I've reported this to Bevesta. What atoms? I've been to all these locations in all my other characters about two times now and I still haven't unlocked it so who knows, we may get them in this playthrough, I do not know. But yeah, so in this playthrough we are wandering all the way back down here to see what we can find. So we need to just wander down this road, well we'll get a crossover and see what these are. Then we'll go over there, there's a level 170 there so we're going to have to be careful. But I did buy some new poses with the atoms I recently got. Uh, my new poses are photo mode are nuclear glare was quite good you can actually use a pistol or sniper rifle with that pose actually i'll actually show you what i mean oh that's the confetti one as you just heard so if i get my pist uh black powder pistol then i go to photo mode oh i need to grab it out first photo mode then if i go to poses so you can have your thingy out doesn't work with all poses, the best thing to use I would say is grab my pistol. I don't think it would work with submachine gun, let me just check. I've never done it with a subby before. I know it works on this one, yeah. But I wonder if it works on the confetti one. Knock out. No it doesn't, you see. That's my confetti one, so it's always confetti. But I can't have a handgun in this hand, so I might do that later on as a pose. See, I just like that one, that one just looks amazing. So yeah, I just got them too, just for the fun of it, you know. Nothing's going to go wrong or anything like that. I just thought it would be funny to have them. So, like, do we need any water while I'm here? Just in case. Uh, any water? I've got no... Yeah, I've got pure fat water, but I'll pick up some dirty just in case. There we go. Hopefully this level thingy does not attack me. I'm praying it doesn't. Oh, there's someone's camp here. Oh yeah, it's this dude, level 34, he's got his camp right here. Cool, nice camp. And, um, alright, so we need to go. Most of you may see recently on Twitter, I have, well, time I'm recording this, you should have seen it, because this video will come out in the last month. So this will come out about the first, well, about the 20th or something like that, so the final days of the month of January I think we're in the first month so basically the first month of this year I've now fully recorded every single video I'm now on to the second month and I'm only in the first month it's only like the what's Tuesday the seventh I'm already on to now on to next month's um recording so I'm well planned ahead guys so that's what I'm doing and we're well, just taking out the guards so yeah I did recently tweet out about my clean spaceman suit and clean. Um, other suits. Here's quite good. I might, I might do, let me see this. I may end up doing, may have a video beforehand or not on it. I just don't know. So if, I, so if you're not, so if you haven't actually seen the time this video goes out live, uh, look on my Twitter. Because that's where I normally post all my videos and the rest. Well, not my vid well, I'll post my videos and pictures of stuff I've done in game as well. So if you want to see little snippets of things I've done, I'll always do it on there and the rest, what's well, always quite good. I do go to some stupid things on my other characters. Like uh, pictures taken, me messing around, getting killed by super mutants, or just charging into places. Um, just in my underwear attacking a death claw what's level 90 and I'm just doing oh turn you off I'm level 9 he's level 90 and I'm like level 60 I'm just in my underwear attacking it it's always stupid thing to do I know but it was hilarious once I just took a screenshot of it 
Ah, uh, you can do some very silly things on this game. Oh, it's a super mini flash, you know me. Come on, super. Dumbass. That's right, you're a dumbass. Farm Hannah Claus baseball. Is this someone else? Oh, I'm a dumbass because I just fell off. Let's try to snipe on my step back and just fell off the roof. Climb all the way back up. So, I was going to go up these stairs here. Where is he? He's there. Come on, Swim Ewan. That's right, you big dumb green meanie. You did me out. Uh, anything worth that? Actually, let's let's see what my daily challenges are for today. Uh, challenges daily. All right, I've nearly done them. Uh, I'm not even bothered doing them. So I just need to get screws and gears in the rest. So we'll keep our eyes out for anything like that. But we will take the sugar bombs here. Is this is the only thing. What leads up? Oh wait, there's no door here. Nothing really of value. Duct tape. Uh, this sort of always handy on this character. And we need to go up these stairs. Anything inside this room? Nope, nothing really value. The bridge going across there, so we'll just keep going up. Oh, dead sat now, a hunting rifle. So this is all made out of the crashed aeroplane, what basically crashed here at one before, well, just after the bombs fell. Oh, you're a high level. You've got a nail through your foot, so that's obviously why you're like Climb down the stairs a second. Take a stim pack. As you can see there, he's got a nail strip for his foot there. Oh, he's... Damn, he's gone all the way down there. Right, we'll grab his corpse in a bit. Jail cell key, ammo, pre-war money. Steamer trunk, 50 cal, baseball powder, nothing on here. So right, we'll just keep going down. Down the stairs we go. To get this dude's corpse, like so. Yeah, he had a bit on him. But now we need to go all the way back up, so we can cross this little bridge to get to this side. And then we'll see what's all over there. I can smell you out there, you little sneaky. Okay, apparently I'm sneaky, apparently. I can't be that sneaky if, I, if you heard all my gunshots. I didn't say that, buddy. Bad clipboards normally give you some stuff, I think. Green shirt and combat boots. I might take that as a backup outfit. Let's just check my junk. Bad clipboard springs. Well, springs were all the ones I needed. I'm sharp, I don't want that. Daily. Springs, yes. Screws, gears. So springs, screws, gears. I'll try and get them in this one. If not, I'll do them on my other character on my own time. It's always good just to take a look around and see what we can grab. Anything over here? Ball caps. Take them. Uh, nothing on you. You've got some stuff. Anything in here? No. You've got some stuff. Thank you. Dead settler. Plates. Nothing much in here. Unless the jail cell system has already been in here. There is a note here. Horizon Rest Armory. I can't believe I convinced everyone to pull their weapons and lock them in the armory. Hanging from the tower. That idiot been running the show ever since we left Elevation, but I think it's time for a change. Isolate her key to the army and left it under the flower pot in my shack. Let's say I tried to to call the shots now. There's an armory? Where the hell's the armory? I don't even see the armory. That's somewhere up there. Oh, right, the armory must be up there. Right, under a flower pot, he said, didn't he? There we go. <laughs> we pay attention. That was like, nice hope. Flower pot. First shack we're going to has a flower pot. So this plane went down pretty hard then if it's smashed up all over here. Hello. Anyone home? Is that military fatigues? Yay, buddy. We're getting some clothes new. Right, let's have a look at my clothes, shall we? 
Right, let's change with these, shall we? Let's, let's have a look. Oh, wait, I can wear the. Where? Let's take off the military fatigue first. Cool, I can wear the military fatigues. Uh, put that on then. Oh no, so military fatigues go underneath the green one, okay. I'm just gonna wear the military fatigues because they look nicer. And it's part of my dirty army helmet. And my gas mask. So just having a look around, nothing much here. Yeah. I don't even know where the armory is. That's the ironic thing. So it's. Oh, we're looking for an armory. Oh, there's a chem box under there. Can I grab that chem box? So it was in a note, right? Let's have a look at the notes. High rise and rest armory. Uh, I can't believe I convinced everyone to pull their weapons and lock them in the armory hanging from the tower. So hanging from the tower. So this is the tower. Right. And he said hanging. Oh. Is this the armory here? Yes, it is. I'm done. Oh. Oh, my knees. My knees. My knees. My character's getting too old for this rubbish, guys. <laughs> I don't think my character doesn't like me beating her up as much. So let's see what we can get inside this armory. Hopefully some good bits. Maybe some more ammo for my submachine gun. I do like it. Right, jump carefully. There. Armory door is open. So we have some shotguns. We have some ammo. Plans. Short. Oh, I think we already have them. Shocks and shotgun stock. Frag grenades, more frag grenades, uh, ammo, radar strength and lime armor. Don't, I'll just take that and sell it actually. Dinner plate, no ammo. Don't need any of these weapons, so we'll just leave the weapons here. Yeah. I had tons of hunting rifles and shotguns. So they could have easily defended themselves, but no, she was an idiot and. He locked away the armory key and everybody got attacked by super mutants. Shame there, like. Could really use them weapons. But now we're gonna head off up to the radio tower, I think. And then we'll continue travelling down the hill. So I just wanna try and get everywhere in the forest region. I know we need to go up here and see what that is and the rest. So we'll go over there again when we come back over this way eventually. Then we'll do this location here. Because we've got to go there eventually anyway. I'll walk up there. There. Then we'll head back down. Actually no. We'll go there. Then we'll backtrace to there. Then we'll backtrack all the way back down here to there. Sounds like a complicated plan. I know. But hey. I like complicating this apparently. We may get some enemies. Attack us now and then. But who knows. We will try to do our best as we can. Let me just grab this a second. Yeah, that's fine. Perfect. So, we may get attacked by super mutants here. Right. Just checking the timer on my clock to make sure I have not done anything. Oh, I do not want to turn to the top of the world signal. So that's for the different quest, but later on. We'll do that much later on, guys. We're jumping way too many quests ahead there. Whoa, did them turrets just self-destruct before I even got there? Okay, I guess that's a celebrationary victory, I guess. Oh no, there's a super mutant there. Down on the ground, Federation officers. I repeat, Federation officers, get on the ground. Whoa. Down on the ground. Down on the ground. You will never alive. Have a hand grenade, buddy. Completely missed, I know. Stimmy. Oh, God, I've got no stimmies. That's not good. I'm getting rads. Ha! Ah, did it! I'm a victory. <laughs> I survived with minimal health. Right, let's have a look. Do I have any blood packs? Uh, blood pack one. 
and I'll boost my health up a little. Right, where's his corpse? What did I blow up back here? I have no clue why I blew up. Oh, it's the jeep. Okay, I blew up the jeep. Don't know what happened here, but oh well, we'll take them while we forget. Right, pinboard, and we got maps. Let's see. Uh, where there? Train yard we've just unlocked. We've got that tower that looks like anything else. Yep, there's something over here. Another radio tower. Grifton Dam. There's that. And that's all the map marks it's going to give us. Okay, so that was quite good. Tongs. Da 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 da. Okay, not much around here. I think in your meat pile, no. Can dog food and fury. I'll take them. Even though I don't use the chems, I sell them, so it's always going to be more money for me later on. Uh huh. There ain't nothing up here. So we need to go now to. I say we'll go here. Then we'll backtrack up here and take this road, what it says here, all the way over there. So we will go over this way. Quest may appear or may not appear, because I know there's a quest at this resort place we're going to. Do I have my Molotovs equipped? Just in case. Yes. Where the you? Where the Federation military? And we're here to liberate Appalachia for the atomic spetsnaz. Raise our own flag and claim it as our own new place. Should be fun. Dun 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 dun. It'd be funny if you could actually just chop little trees like that down with a fireman's axe and just take the wood. So many if you could. Like these little trees you should be allowed just to hit and chop down and get stuff from. Right guys, there's our target. I should we take my binoculars with me so I can see what I'm looking at. I guess this, that's where a sniper rifle scope comes in. Got some sort of kids weird drawing. I'm seeing no hostiles at the minute. So we're quite far out, so we may not see them until it's too late. I'm also not seeing any hostiles. Keep advancing. Check. Looks like plenty of radar decor. Right, we've got caution. Right, if we're approaching this location, we want our tomahawks and we want our something special. Ghouls. Nope, apparently that's scorching up. Apparently I'm an absolute terrible shot. Come on. Take that. Yeah. Didn't like went through that. So this is this just a giant fire pit or something of dog here? So it's like an arena or something where they would fight it out. Must be. Gruesome. So right, we'll have a look around here. Alright, dinner plates. Ooh, is that ball vodka? Yep. Don't know what this is. This is like Someone sh two or five people shooting something. I'm not sure what they're shooting. But they're definitely shooting something. Oh, Mr. There's a prize bot there. Would you believe it? I've been looking all over for you. Congratulations! Today is your lucky day. You've won the Great Appalachian Sweepstakes, and this wonderful prize is yours! Five ammo, two tomahawks. Okay, thank you. Oh, and you've made me over and come, bad buddy. Thanks. I do need to scrap some of the stuff I've got anyway, like, so I'll do that in a bit. If I'm finding a workbench, I'll scrap it all while I'm here. Thanks, buddy. Actually, do you want to have my power on the frame with me? Because that might give me some weight. Yeah, I do. I jump in this and will it give me some extra carry weight possibly? I cannot remember if it's just the frame or gives it the carry weight. Or do I need actual sonics? 
No, I've got a Nova in Clumber now. Four and a half, right, yo. Right, we need to find a workbench dramatically then. Prize bot. Sorry, prize bot. You did give me some good. You made me overweight, so I just shot you. I know I'm horrible to prize bots, aren't I? If there's any other bot, I would be alive, but still. Let's have a look. He is dead. I don't have a torch on either, so that's the most annoying thing. I need a torch. I shall stir for a robot. Okay, apparently my top hook went through the door. That's a new one, okay. Uh, anybody on this side of the room? Ah, uh, doesn't this have vias? Yes it does, and it has springs. Whoa! Buddy! Oh! Yeah. Oh well, tomahawk. I'll have to get rid of all my tomahawks now, if I can. I'm in the board games room. We can play pool, everybody. We round up and we'll play pool. Oh, there's a pool hole now. Okay, this is the deep end of the pool. So we're going to launch the jet ski. Uh, anything of value? Probably some desk fans. I can scrap those. Raider corpse. Do I really not have like. Minus. Yeah, I do have a minus hat, don't I? Oh, well, I've got a bit of light now. Probably all these hand grenades, that's probably what's weighing me down. I may get rid of the baseball ones. I keep the hand grenades because they're ha handy and I keep the molotovs because they're also handy. A lot of meat bags as well. Oh, ammo. Ta um, short I need to break some of these down. I may have to teleport somewhere just to find a workbench. I well, don't know what to do. Come on, please, there's a workbench in here. Anybody? No workbench, but a ton of blood. Oh, I don't know what I picked up there. Raider symbols, this place is just all grotty and grimy. Dog meat steaks. Ah, oh, there's a workbench there. Oh, d oh no, it's the cooking workbench. You can't scrub anything on. Damn it. Yeah. Damn you. Golf suits, golfers outfits, okay. Level one, I'll do that. Oh, bobby head. Oh, bobble head. Oh, we'll tell, let's listen. Edie and I have been feeling a little extra hungry of late, and the others are starting to ask questions. Boris, how can you be hungry when you're still so fat? <laughs> you know what I say to that. I'm hungry because I'm a boss here. Hot effort to wrangle these useless idiots so we don't all starve. And that works up an appetite. Honestly, it's been several days since we've come across any more food. Usual unsuspecting travelers have been harder to come by. I can only assume the damn cutthroats have been scaring them all away or not sharing. Okay, 
That's quite interesting. Here's the little message there. And also, you may just see now I just shot him twice in the head and he didn't die. So that was quite interesting. Um, so yeah. I'm still looking for a workbench. I still haven't found any. But this place is covered in blood, I can say that. We've got a terminal to read downstairs, so we'll take a one down there in a minute and see what that is. Now there's a crazy bear there with red eyes. So I have to just stay in my power armor or we're going to be extremely aware and club right. Now there's this terminal here we're going to read. Then we'll read the other one. Outgoing patient mail. Okay. To all patients of the Bolton Green Appalachians. Director Bolton, congratulations and very hard to report that you your child has been accepted to the daycare program at Bolton Greens. This program is one of the most prestigious of this eastern seaboard. Your child will have access to the state of the art facilities such as our nine hole golf course, a full staffed horse riding stables, a robot robust art program, unique team building exercises and event of business. Our motto at Bolton Green is now plus V what trying to say is nothing can be been. That's the standard we live here by. Okay, I'm not going to read possibly all these because these are like quite a lot. Yeah. But I'm not going to bother reading all them. Because <laughs> you know what I'm like for reading, guys. It'll take us all day. I think we're going on. So I guess we can get a bit of an idea of what is going on here. Looks like this is a prestigious school or something for the posh. Um, so it help children come back golfers and the rest. So this is a pretty nice location. Someone's already killed all these like. So yeah. Very nice. Really well done. So I'd say we continue onwards now. And we'll head all the way over to to this location here. So we need to just head over to this road. Yeah, as you already I might do another like video about this place because this place is quite interesting. I might spend some time reading the terminals myself and then see what kind of interesting lore we can dig up about this place. Because I don't really do lore videos, I just do interesting fact finding mission things. There's a few fun finding facts places. Nice, right, so this is the road we need to walk here. We are staying in power armor until we can uh, successfully find a workbench and break down most of the junk we've got. What's in here? Stem pack. That's pretty handy and whoa now that is creepy. Cool. I'm gonna find my thumbnail for today. Do something of like a horror show standard. Uh, what type should we go for? I was going to use a new pose possibly, but oh well. I want something like, some total creepiness. Black and white's pretty good. Oh yeah, that one's pretty good, I like that one, feral. Evilness. I'm just gonna take away that sugar because it's like in the way. I'll just have all the pumpkins and the rest in. Right. So like so we need to go to Feral, wasn't it? Feral Vintage. There we go, our good contrast is very like that, then we'll just want to go a bit like that. There we go, we're a nice creepy ass picture. Yep, that should be creepy enough for us today, guys. Great thumbnail, just for something creepy we find along the road. So that is one of the creepiest things I've found so far on the roads bar a few other things and that gnome had a knife what's even more concerned so I have no clue what was going on there but the gnomes have always in the fallout law been evil they've always killed people buried people or murdered other toys so I'm sure the gnomes are like 1000% evil in the fallout universe so there's hundreds of references where you could easily find the gnomes being evil we haven't found much yet right 
on this road. So we are heading up to a location where there should be a workbench. Oh no, correctly, there should be a workbench this next location. Where we should be able to break down most of the equipment we don't need and we could use it for other stuff. So let's have a look. Adjustable wrench is always handy. Oh man, I picked up one thing and I'm totally uncombed. Right, uh, gold ore. I'll drop that. Yeah, that's probably back on the way. Hang in here, no, no. Hang in this one. Oh, duffel bags. Plenty of money, someone was smuggling money. And someone was smuggling dirty water. Okay. Sounds interesting. Smuggling a lot of stuff. Alright, we're now approaching the location. This little cabin here where this level 29 is. Then we'll head down this road to there, then we'll just head around this side of the lake until we get back around to the medical centre. This is a perfectly logical plan ish. Guys, we can do some hunting for XP. Hold on, where's my marksman's rifle? Damn it, I'm a useless shot, so I didn't spook them. Dead. 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 Now we're all, we got some food, guys. Sean killed this military soldier here, it died as well on this road. I'm over in Clumber as well, by taking the meat. Great. Oh, I can eat the meat now. And we blew their brains out, as you can see. Clearly blew their brains out. How nice. Right, where's their meat? Let's drop all the dirty water, actually. Crumb drops, melon. Also, I need to get to a thingy soon and eat it. Damn it. Where's my disease cure? Because I'm not in dysentery. There we go. You recovered from parasites. Apparently, I've got no disease, apparently. 14 minutes. Damn it. I may just have to go around the world without no water then. Apparently, I can't cure that. Apparently, my disease cure. Here we go. White powdered winter sports. Whatever this place is, we're going to use it. We need to scrap a ton of stuff anyway. And we may want to get out of our soon. Anyone home? I like how this cabin's just like proper built into the ground. It's quite nice. Right, so we're going to scrap our drunk on this one. Oh, uh, scrap gears. That's good. Scrap stuff for springs. We've got that. Skiing outfit hat. Okay. Super stim pack. Access adhesive. Oh my, I didn't mean to take the greaser jacket. Where the hell's the greaser jacket? Oh no, that one. I'm on my green shirt and boots. It's like my military clothing. Oh, hi. Hopefully he doesn't attack me for my loot because I'm carrying quite a bit. Damn, I should, I'm going to have to break these down possibly a thingy workbench, aren't I? Nope. Do I still have a submachine gun? Nope, I just scrapped all my subbies. Damn it, I'm gonna have to go back and get another one sometime. At least I know where I can get them from. But at least I've got parts for them now. So that's the handy thing. And he killed all the super mutants here. So that's no handy thing. Employee's terminal. Not really a value in the fridge. Right, employee's terminal. I think here. Yeah. Oh, these are just different logs. Yeah. Say about the things what would happen here and the rest. So let's see. There's no like red rocket truck stops or anything along this route. So I say we we'll get here. We'll go there. Then I may 
have to teleport to my camp quickly. Oh no, the servers are not responding there. I seen that message. Do not give me that message, Bavesta. Right, then I will. Yeah, servers are definitely not responding because I click remove map marker. Yeah. What is that message? What's popping up? Hold on. See, that message is so fast I can not read it. So about console something. See that? I'm going to have to pause it when I'm ending this video and see what that message says. That's so annoying that it's just popping up like that. It's like, what? I know I've got nothing to record downloading, I can say that. I think I've got running this my PC, what I need running, because that's what I'm streaming to, to get my video recording off my Xbox, and that's about it. So that is strange. So I think after I, after this video, depending on how far I've gotten the timer, after I end it, I may end up just quit our points top onto my camera and the world's longest walk all the way back to where we need to be. I'm seeing nothing here. Nope. Right, we'll approach I'm not gonna investigate our trailer because that trailer it's going to give me the world's longest quest in history. I know it does. Trust me. I'm not a silly game. This quest here is the daily the bulgy one. Basically, you have to go to here, get some documents, come back, log on here, then it sends you anywhere in this in the forest region. So all the way up to here, all the way around where it's all green, to get data samples. And it can take a little bit an hour itself. I wouldn't want to pay to fast travel around and do it. So we're already discovering this place. I'm going to leave it because I'm going to do that in a separate video someday. When I actually have time. Because this one will run into about 24 minutes. Until we hit the hours mark. So I'm going to end this sooner than normal. What the? There's an eyebot floating in the sky up there. Take that down. He was just flying in the air. Strange. That's all I've got to say, people. Well, hundreds of. Not eyebots, then. Um, communist bots. Come on. Oh, well, I've got this little brave dude trying to attack me here as well. Mark Zero Liberator. You are being a hero for your country. Now you're dead. People trying to be heroes for their country. It never works out in the end, guys. Never be a hero. It's never gonna get far. What? There's smoke and wreckage here. Uh, okay, there's a ton of scorch. Was he literally just, like, hands down by his side? Hovering towards me. That is quite scary, me, I see. I don't even know where he died. Oh, he died right here. Fireman's axe. Got that. Da, 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 da. Plans. Travel legs. Okay. Binoculars. That's what this tent was smoked from. I'll take them because I can easily scrap them later on if I don't need them. Uh, no, plans, where's my plans? Yeah. Yeah, I've got all them. Right, yo, so. There's a bulldozer there. Oh no, stand still. Do not move that to my PC there, tell me something's going wrong. I just need to check some guys. So you probably see a load of dials and numbers come out on the street now. We're seeing total bandwidth from the rest. Max 25, average time. Last. Yeah, it's fine, man. It just had a giant spike for no reason. 
I know I did just buy a game today. Well, pre-ordered a game. Download later on. But that should not be happening. But that's paused and all that. I've just... Did someone attack me? Because my car just went oof again for some strange reason. Let's have a look. Oh, God. We got scorched looking at that. Sniper rifle quickly. Headshot. Dead. Dead. Oh, there's no one all the way up there. Missed it. Dead. Someone dropped their stuff here. Loose screws. Is that person crazy? I'll take that up. Loose screws. Those screws is like the most vital asset in this game, technically, near enough. Never lose loose screws, man. And this is like this weird little encampment thing. Loose spring, I'll take that. Shotgun shells, gunpowder, yes, yes. I actually need to check which ammo I've picked up, because I never use that, so I'm going to drop that. Ah, I never use that, so I'm going to drop that. So there are two types of ammo I never use, you see. Some string trees, I always seem to pick it up. Oh, I know, I need to get water. Fine, I'll drink some water. How's that sound? I'm drinking a little bit because I don't want to use all my water up. There we go. So, we avoid this town by going down this road and all the way across there. So, I think our first stop is to bear. So, if we get there, then I might end it all the way on that side. That seems to have sense of place. Also, I am going to move my camp soon so I can get a junk machine. I do like it by the water side, but I also like having a junk pile thing. So I can get junk. So I don't have to go always scavenging for stuff. It's always handy to go scavenging, like. But still. And a hoarder of nuclear cola as well. Uh, anything? Over here in this toolbox? Nope. Right. No lot you do build their camps down here on the wall. Oh, there's rabbits. Hello, rabbits. I'm not here to harm you. I could actually shoot you and use you for the meat, but hey, you're just cute. Look at them. Look at them, guys. Look. The little hops. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, did I actually squish one? Oh, here we go. I didn't squish any. Ah, oh, well. Who knows? If I did, I did. If I did, I did. This person is just chilling out on here. Why was this? I don't know if you can build where that shack is. Yeah, guys, you can actually build where this shack is. So you'd have a pre built house and everything. Look, no, it's destroyed. Oh, and you'd have a trap ready. Welcome, make yourself at home. Drinks are on me. Okay, don't live in this place. Ignore my last request. And stay away from here. This person is crazy. Nope, these are just all empty BLs. And he had a doll. So, if you don't get this reference, guys, do not ask. If you're an adult, you should get that reference. Yes. Human were doll. That's all I'm saying. Come on. Only this one was I mean, Yeah, he's right. Come on. Yeah, we well, got him. Might take all that. So that's a good little place you could set up a house if you don't mind all the crazy dolls and the rest living there, will you? What am I doing? I should just get my binoculars where I can see further. Ah, that house is all boarded up. Wouldn't mind if you could actually place your camp at one of them locations, guys, right? But it would be like a pre-built interior, like a normal inside house. 
both go in. But it would just be a shell. So basically you just have a shell of the house so you can just remove all the boarded up windows and doors and just make it yours. Give me a nice little house in the end. So this is the little place we want to go first. Then we'll explore all these houses as we go along. The only house we won't explore is this one because this one's part of a quest. I'll uh, rather just explore it when we get to the quest. It's more fun when we do it that way. But for now we'll see what this location is. Then we'll end it once we see what this is. Overlook Cabin. Okay, we're at Overlook Cabin. Grab some wood. Hello. Cap stash. 14 caps. That's all I can see what I'm doing. Uh, nothing much here. Anything on this balcony? Nope. Oh, there's a hall tape. Let's play. Hey, Kelly, I got your message from the dead drop. I've been waiting up here for you, but I'm starting to get kind of worried. Oh, you're probably just hiding in the hedges with those robots. But I'm going to go look around for you. If you get this, just stay here. I ran into a few adults who used to live in the big houses here, and they say that we can stay for as long as we like. I told the other kids, and everyone's pretty sure they're cannibals. Damn, I'm <laughs> sure about that, I'm I don't think it's true. But we should probably try to move on from here if the folks here are taking notice. Oh, hey, <laughs> there you are now. So, bye. Okay, that was interesting note. We can say that for sure. Basement, where we'll head down to the basement in a minute. Hello? Are you wanting this dark creepy? Basement? I'm a Federation officer. I have my orders to take this facility at all costs. And you were not willing to surrender. You try to turn around and flee, so we just try to shoot you there. May it also repair my arm or something. Vault 76 jumpsuit. Damn, I've already got that one, but I know who needs that. that my, my other character actually needs that one. So I could actually go and get my friend on later and hopefully he can help me transfer to my other character. That would be perfectly nice if that was the case. So I'll head upstairs and see what we can find up there. Oh! You fired first, I return fire. Simple policy, mate. You never shoot a Federation officer. That's just not the way. Da -dun, da -dun, da -dun. Okay, some sort of kids' room. Very nice. Pretty creepy. But it's nice. I like it. I dig it. Nothing around here. I hear more screams. Drop the axe! Jesus, what is with these people today, man? They're threatening me with axes. The rest are just not very nice people, man. You've got to admit, man. You've got to be more player like this. They have people coming in and inspect this facility. They've just got to be more acceptant and more polite. Oh, some dude there with a bad fedora and he's wearing a suit. At least he has a swim pool and the rest. Ah, very nice. Looks like there's a pier there what would go down to the boat. But alright. What's the... Oh, is this the attachment? Yeah, this is the attached building. Right. So I guess I'm going to end this video here for today. But we are going to continue our adventures to get this T-Fuse back in and load the blood samples in. So right guys, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down. If you have any questions at all about this video or any of our videos guys, put them down in the cards below and I'll try and answer them the best of my ability I can guys. But until next time, I am Victor Barisov, signing off. Until next time guys, bye.